I watched season one, episode two of Augie and the Cockroaches Next Generation, where I could find serious lessons on the water crisis, which we all can understand, learn, and take action so that our wells never run dry. So, without any further ado, let's dive into the episode. Okay, we start with our usual habit of wasting water when there's plenty. We have often told children to save water, but as per EPA, an average U.S. family wastes 180 gallons per week through household leaks. We shouldn't be ignoring leaks and waiting for disaster to strike. It's also good for the environment. We also waste water by turning on the tap when not in use, using fresh water for outdoor tasks, and then we complain about why city authorities are stopping the water supply in dry months. Please, fresh water doesn't come from heaven. It's scarce. We have to get from rivers and wells and treat it thoroughly to ensure it's safe to drink. Let's not waste fresh water when it's in plenty so that our taps don't dry in peak summer months. Augie got the plan of digging his own well to make up for the dry summer. Idea is good, but when everyone digs their own well, then the water table falls and droughts become common, as is the case with Oregon recently. The problem is the same in other parts of U.S. A like Texas, Arizona, and California. We grow water-thirsty crops, we destroy our environment, we overpump and make multiple wells, and then cry why water isn't there. It's high time we stop doing this. So what are the ways to recharge water table and solve water crisis? Aggie got the natural recharge at the end of the episode. Rain. We should deploy rainwater harvesting techniques like roof catchment systems and cisterns to adequately recharge groundwater for everyone to benefit. Because how many times you'll deepen wells or dig new wells? Let's work together to solve our water crisis for all. I know it's hard, but together we can do it. Subscribe to Aquaprofessor for more such insightful facts and tips.